The animation that you are about to see demonstrates the remarkable simplicity and ease of use of the new Aqueduct removable and reusable fiberglass trench forming system from Aco Polymer Products, the world leader and pioneer of modular trench drain systems. Step one is to assemble the grate frames by joining the individual frame rails with a series of removable crossbars. Only three crossbars are required for a typical 20-foot length. A pair of saw horses worked quite well for this process. The next step is to attach the fiberglass forms to the grate frames. This is accomplished by turning the grate frames upside down on the saw horses, then sliding the walls of the forms into the slot formed by the vertical surfaces of the frame rails and the crossbars. Two bolts at each crossbar location are tightened to secure the form. This animation presumes an installation in existing pavement, so hanging devices are now attached. Numerous other installation techniques exist for virtually any site condition. Preparation of the installation area includes such things as the installation of expansion joint material, placement of reinforcing steel, and any necessary shaping of outlet pipes to properly mate with the fiberglass forms. Placement of the assembled forms should begin at the outlet points and proceed toward the high points. Once all forms are in place, additional crossbars are installed to span the joints between form assemblies. This aids in both vertical and horizontal alignment. Next, the hanging devices are fastened to the surrounding concrete using tap cons or similar concrete fasteners. The final step before concrete placement is the installation of wood bracing into the deeper forms. This prevents deformation due to hydrostatic pressure from the wet concrete. Concrete should be placed in two lifts, the first lift coming just to the top of the radius bottom of the forms. Care should be taken to place concrete evenly along both sides of the forms. The second lift completes placement of the concrete. Of course, both lifts must be thoroughly consolidated using an appropriate concrete vibrator. The deforming process involves only a few simple steps. Removal of the hanging devices, removal of the crossbars and wood bracing, and finally removal of the fiberglass forms themselves. All of these components are reusable, so they should be set aside and protected. The final step is the installation of the grates and grate lockdown bolts if required. Once this is completed and the concrete has sufficiently cured, the completed trench is ready for traffic. For additional information on this or any of the many other innovative products from ACO, contact our offices at 440-285-7000 or 520-421-9988 or see us on the web at www.acousa.com.